What do you do when you're waiting for the afternoon swell to hit? Just in time for lunch. <laughs> I've arrived in paradise, and it's just a short flight from Brisbane and Sydney. The Solomons are one of the Pacific's more unfamiliar gems. There are 992 islands here, half of which are uninhabited, much like the surf breaks. But it's more than just an adventurer's playground. There's beauty amongst battlefields, <laughs> tradition amongst history, and stories amongst smiles. My pleasure. History could have been completely different if it hadn't been for these white sandy shores. You see, in 1943, on a pitch black night, JFK heroically dragged one of his crewmates four kilometers to this island after their patrol boat was rammed by a Japanese destroyer. Incredible. The island became known as Kennedy Island, and it's a stone's throw from Fat Boys one of Gizo's best resorts, and the perfect spot to be based if you're a keen diver. With over 50 aircraft and shipwrecks across the country, the diving is world class. And a lot of these are accessible to recreational divers year round. Yet, the only crowds you'll find are the inhabitants. the best history lesson I've ever had. And thanks to passionate locals like Barney, you don't need to get your feet wet to experience the enormity of what took place here. The battles resulted in huge losses on all sides, but the Allied invasion is considered one of the most important successes of World War II. Many relics still sit just as they were left, and sometimes for good reason. Uh, one thing that really intrigues me about this place are the stories. Take this place, for example. It's called Skull Island. It's where local tribes would bring back the heads of their enemies and put them on display. I've been told that it was a competition between the tribes on who could collect the most heads. Don't take anything, though. Just look, because there is a curse. That's enough to send shivers down your spine. Thankfully, these traditions have been cast away because I was about to witness the real deal. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Fine. Hey! Oh. Come on! Come on. <laughs> Travelling is a gift in itself, and when people openly share their world with you... <laughs> Beautiful. ...you realise you're not just a tourist. You're a part of something bigger. <laughs> so good. It's delicious. Thank you. Can you wear this one? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Hang on. <laughs> I'm now the fisherman, and you're presenting the rest of the show. Is that okay? Yeah, okay, thank you. Got it! Got it! I don't remember the last time I felt so welcome by the smiles of so many strangers. Well, I couldn't leave without just saying goodbye. I'm gonna say thank you. I'd like to say on behalf of everyone back home in Australia, thank you for having me today. This is for you. As a destination, the Solomon Islands are extremely unique. Devoid of the usual tourist traps, it's an unexplored adventure amongst an undiscovered paradise. Come find your untold story.